Hey guys, it's Pokemon Dan here. Due to the sheer number of different decks that I've been given because of my episodes, I've decided to make deck surgery into a separate series of videos. This way, my episodes stay shorter because the last one was way too long and I can get through much more of your lists. As you can see, I have all these names of YouTube users that have sent in deck lists to me and I've put them into this online randomizer. So to choose who gets their list shown in each each different mini episode. I'm going to put all the names in here and let the randomizer choose. So the first deck list of the mini episodes will be owned by Cinder's Park 1. So Cinder's Park 1, here's your deck and what I would suggest to fix it. This is the list that he gave me. As you can see, this is a build of the most popular deck in the current format, Luxchomp. I decided to run a list very similar to this during the Battle Road season, so I should be able to give you some good pointers. Your Pokemon list looks really good. A minor thing that is lacking is Uxie Level X, but we all know that it's one of the most expensive cards at the moment, and he said he doesn't have access to one. This would help the Machamp matchup, but the list of Pokemon you have here is great. As for trainers and supporters, I would run them a little bit differently. I've been testing with Junkarn recently in my Luxchomp build, and it's a great card, but I just can't find the space for it. I think that Twins may be the better play, as it can guarantee you two cards of your choice if you fall behind on prizes. I've used this many times in a lot of games, so I'd recommend testing it. Another thing I noticed is that you only run two Power Spray. Power Spray is one of the most disruptive cards in the format, and can keep the game in your control after spraying crucial powers. I would suggest taking out your fourth energy gain for a third Power Spray. As for the supporters, two Arons is a better play I feel, over one Arons and a Palmer's, but do consider running one Arons and pairing that with a VS Seeker. I have started doing this in all my SP lists, and I find myself rarely needing two Arons. The VS Seeker gives you the option of getting the extra Arons if you need it, but it can also get you the crucial 5th Cyrus or a second Twins against Machamp. Overall, this list is well built and the energy line is looking nice too. Thanks for sending in your list, and I hope I helped. If any more of you are interested in sending in your lists, please send me a message on YouTube and you could be the next one chosen from the list. That's it for this mini episode, so thanks for watching.